Alright, hello everyone. Welcome back to Fire Emblem Sake. I was gonna say Sacred Stones. No, this is Three Houses. Last time we took care of both of the uh, prologue battles that we had left. This time we've actually got a conversation between Ash and Mercedes. So let's see what that's about. Whoa, what happened? The pan smoking! <coughs> Mercedes, <coughs> what's going on? Uh, my eyes. I can barely breathe. Oh, Ash. I'm so glad you're here. My cooking's not going very well at all. What did you put in there? I used some of this spice, that seasoning, and the herbs on the top shelf. Then I started frying it in oil. That explains it. <coughs> we use that herb for smoke bombs. Just turn the heat off and cover the pan. People in the dining hall don't look so good. Sorry, everybody. Could we clear out the dining hall for a few minutes, please? Well, some folks were a little annoyed, but at least we got the place cleared out. It's a good thing no one mistook all that smoke for an attack. That could have been a disaster. I'm so sorry. I always mess everything up. No, it's my fault. I should have taught you which herbs to avoid. Don't blame yourself. I just need to figure out how to do it right for next time. Next time? You still want to try again, even after all that? Of course! If I didn't, that would just be a waste of everything you taught me. I guess that's true. If you quit every time you made a mistake, then you'd never learn anything, right? That's a great point. Maybe my mistake was frying the herb in oil. If I had boiled it instead, then there wouldn't be smoke. What do you think, Ash? Boiling, huh? Yeah, that'd be fine. Great! I'm gonna get this right next time for sure. Well, that's nice. Uh, as far as certifications go, most people failed. I was just trying different things. I did get to do to be a fighter, so he's going to be doing that. Uh, Sylvain actually did get the paladin. It was pretty simple for him. There's not really anything for Mercedes and Annette I really wanted. I tried for Ingrid to get the paladin, didn't work out. Dorothea got priestess, but... And uh, not really necessary. Got the mage for her. Uh, that's pretty much it. Um, I re-upped everyone's battalion and everything, and I also went ahead and switched the battalions around just a little bit. But all in all, we're going to be good. I am grateful. Well, fantastic. <laughs> the sealed forest is up ahead. Stay alert. This is for Captain Gerald. I will not falter. It is time to repay the kindness of the professor who saved my life. Leave it to us, professor. I'll give it my all. Fighting to Moss? It will be difficult, that's for certain. I don't really love the idea of fighting people I know. We don't have a choice. Even if it's difficult, an enemy is an enemy. We've just got to get it over with. Just kill them from behind. As long as you don't see their faces, you won't know if you know them. We won't know unless we see their face. Yes, I suppose that is true. Professor, I hope you know I meant what I told you before. Your enemy is my enemy, and I will follow you until the end, whatever that end may be. That's reassuring. Yes, right. We'll fulfill our duty together. We've come this far. We can't stop now. I hope you know that you can rely on us. No matter who the enemy is, we are prepared to cut them down. Yes. No matter who they may be. My 
Thank you so much. Well, seems like Thanks so much. Dimitri knows something that he's not telling us. Thank you so, so. much. Much appreciated. All right. For this fight, you are given ten people you can take with you, like always. You can't take Shamir or Catherine in this. Um, these two are taking a backseat. I do want to bring Lysithia. She's going to be very useful here. Um... I mean, gosh, Dedu's not bad, it's just his stat, well, okay, I'll, I'll rephrase that. His stats are horrific, <laughs> but I still want him to gain the experience needed, so he's going to be an adjutant, but he's not actually going to fight. I do want to bring Sylvain, and I do want to bring Ash. Um, in, well, yeah. Ingrid can sit this one out. Uh, Blythe, uh, you are going to have to do as your backup. Um, uh, Ash, how about you and Annette hang out? All right, so this is who I want the experience gem for. It increases the amount of experience gained. Well, she has Mastermind, which doubles the experience. So she has this and it gets doubled. So that really helps her out with getting her uh, classes mastered, any of this experience, this gets doubled, it just makes it so much easier to make her something ridiculously powerful. So, that's why I didn't really give her anything, because I knew I was going to give it to her at some point. Alright, so, I'm not going to really do that, I'm going to use Fiendish Blow, just so when she's actually attacking with magic, she'll do some more damage. But, as always with dancer classes, they can allow someone to move once again. Uh, I will say the dance in this game is kind of just kind of bleh. It's not all that... It, like, Tethys's and even Nenian's dance from the previous two Fire Emblem games I've played on this channel, they had much better dances than the one in this game. I'm just going to put this out there. Okay. Regardless, uh, we're gonna... I think we'll be fine. And let's get into this. Demonic beasts! The enemy was always intending to lure us here. Yes, they were. Hello, you're here! Welcome to the Forest of Death. <laughs> My name is Kranya. This weakling girl was just a borrowed look for me. <laughs> this is what I really look like. Now, you vermin, I'll take down every last one of you. Stay focused. Alright. For this mat, it. You can go ahead and use the Sword of Creator. It's gonna be something that's gonna be very useful in this fight. Ash, I don't want you to get in trouble, so kinda keep you back a little bit. Okay. I want you. Oh, I forgot to put that in. Uh, yeah. Equip the Iron Gauntlets. We're gonna be rolling with that. That's my cue. Um. I'm on it. I'll go. 
Sylvain. Ready when you are. Cyril. Here we go. All right. Cut through. They're gonna go this way. Lysithia. We're gonna have go this way. The nice thing about the dancers is they have incredible movement, which they usually didn't, so... Apologies. Yep, there you go, that's the dance. <laughs> it doesn't matter who you have as the person who won the dance. That's the dance. It's really lackluster. And I'm I was disappointed when I first saw it. If this takes too long, I might be forced to escape. Oh, or do you simply intend to let me go? How accommodating of you. As for me, I intend to kill you all. <laughs> yeah. Let the lesson begin. That is that. Now, at this point, I would suggest if you haven't got to this mission, but I would say, well, I'll put it this way. It's better if you get to this mission with Blythe mastering the current class he's on and have had it mastered. That's why I haven't been too concerned if he didn't get it. Because that's a whole nother class to master. I mean, it's not going to be the worst thing ever if it's not mastered by the time this mission's done. It's just a little bit nicer to actually go ahead and have it done. That's just pretty much my old two cents about it. I mean... Should I have held back? Nah. That guy deserved it. Not good enough. Well, quit getting too... Like, <laughs> stats increased every level up. That is that. Oh. There's some cavaliers I'm gonna try to cause some problems. Um Could do that. Could also do this. Of course I won. And just dance for her. Um, let me see. Well, there's not an actual thing to look at. Alright, I just have to keep an eye on it. This is what I do. Yeah. So she actually gained eight experience for a reason. Which is actually really good. Because. Her class, I believe, only does... Well, using that gives you one, and then you get plus so many experience with getting the... I'm here to help. Victory will be ours. You get, like, I think with that class she's at, she, she gets plus two experience with reason, and she gets more experience and then 
it's doubled, so in essence she gets plus and that's how she's getting the plus eight. Have at it. Alright. Um. Really? You couldn't do a crit? Uh, that's asking too much, apparently. Ooh, 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 ooh. That, that, that's bad. That's real bad. Alright, um, hold on. Let's give this a go. You're welcome. Um, let's do this. Hey, he he did a shift. He didn't shift planes, but he he was close to it. It wasn't a moonwalk, it was more like a side shuffle that didn't involve you actually moving your feet. Ow! Jerk. C can we get something really- uh, no. This is gonna be fun. Really? What's with getting hit by a low percentage? This is ridiculous. <laughs> this game is made of it. Oh. I feel like I'm going to have to redo my previous turn. Maybe? Maybe not? I don't know. Oh, no. Oh. I'm actually shocked. Okay. Well... I have Stratage. It, or... Sagittae. So obvious. I, why do I... I keep saying Stratage. For some reason, it's Sagitte. Good night. I don't know what is wrong with that. Ugh. I keep having these giant brain just. My just brain just dies on it for some reason. This is going to hurt, okay? 
nice. I've got many skills, you know. This might be my limit. Um. Uh, trays. No. I can't do that. Uh, Stay vigilant. Take that. Got a magic staff. It's our chance to prevail. All right, he's going to be out of commission. Yeah, you've got Nosferatu. Just heal. Yeah. So. Um, Ash, would you be willing to take this guy out? Come on, dude. I'll give it my all. No, don't do that. Uh, Ready when you are. <laughs> Cyril. There you go. <laughs> I was gonna say, if you missed four times with that much percentage on hit, I would have been really upset. I feel stronger. Fantastic. Everyone's happy. Alright. That was really a dead eye shot. There you go. Wow. Put me in there. And that's Stay all Cyril could ever say. Just wow. You actually did that. Answer is yes. Let the lesson begin. Should I have held back? Um Oh, now I think about it. Totally forgot that thing was there. Um... I'm gonna have to... Yeah, I'm gonna have to get a walk pick. Well, yeah, Ash is up here. <laughs> I'll have to send Ash that way. I love how she's just so nonchalant about that. She's like, I hope you don't me uh, get mad at me for killing you. Or, hey, there was no hard feelings in me utterly destroying you. <laughs> Alright. Um. I'll go. Yeah. That was definitely not good enough. Um. You know what? Yeah, yeah we'll do this. That's my cue. Nope. Dance. This will give Ash another movement. You're a big help. Which will definitely help. Because you want to not mess with Kranya for a minute. 
if you want to get that I'll cut through. chest, obviously. And it's something you probably want to get. Yeah, his avoid is just garbage. Um, I'm on it. Yeah, thanks. Here we go. Apologies. Leave it to me. Um, pretty much a full movement. Thank oh. So much. That was... Alright, whatever. Quite helpful. Almost there. Yeah. You're a big help. A chest key. How about that? Alright. Um let's have you do a heal. Because you're there we go. A C level. I'm really getting the hang of this. Well, that's fantastic. It's a speed ring, but it's still a really good item. Alright, so... Go ahead and just move the avatar in. Or, well, move Blythe in like that, because there's no way if you've actually... really actually used Blythe, which you do have to, to do anything halfway decent in this game. And there's no problem you're gonna have with Kranya, she's kind of a joke. You're a fool to be so brazen. You'll never avenge your father at this rate. <laughs> I'll have to kill you too with my own hands. <laughs> this is gonna hurt. Against her, that's probably the most dangerous thing, but as you can see, she was gonna do garbage damage to her, to us. And even though she can double, she does only four damage. Watch and look. Alright, so, we're going to be moving him into the woods. Oh, how cute! You're trying so hard! But now, it's time to die! This is a... Yeah. It was a maybe. But, he gets that. Which is the most important thing. 
Unfortunately, I have it where he actually doesn't isn't able to activate it now. Um Yeah. That that's really going to hurt. Um Yeah, let's do a bombard. Forbidden spell of Zaharas upon our enemies. Please help me. Was that sorcery? What happened to our professor? They were swallowed by the mystical darkness of the forbidden spell. An eternity wandering in a void of nothingness, never to return to this world. To think we almost had the sword of the creator. That's a lie! There's no way the professor is really dead! That's right. Our professor is no ordinary human. I do not believe our professor has fallen. It is possible that death has yet to find your friend, but there are worse things than death. Drifting through the darkness with no chance of escape, overwhelmed with hopelessness. <laughs> it must be torturous. We cannot abandon hope, your highness. Our professor lives. I know it. You're right. We will save the professor. But first, let's destroy this beast. I'll slice you into a thousand pieces as you watch with horror. You will know true pain before I finally allow you to die! How trite. But if you wish for pain, I shall oblige. If you prefer it so, you shall also be added to the ranks of the dead. right into an enemy's trap. Are you just a boulder that rolls down whatever hill it's on? No, even a boulder has more sense. Apologizing won't make things right. This darkness is terrifying. As you and I are one, I too am trapped within this void. But please consider this. 
This realm of darkness we are in is separate from the world from which you came. I mean that it would take a god to leave this place. In time, our hearts and minds will cease to be. Are you prepared to die? I thought as much. I also do not wish to die. And yet... <sighs> there is no other choice. Do you recall your father's diary? He said you were a child who never cried nor laughed. I think I am the one to blame. I must have been asleep, but even then, I feel I was a part of you. I do not know how Rhea managed it, but she allowed me to exist inside of you. The truth is, I have always been with you. It is within you that I found my power yet again. The power of a goddess. The power of the progenitor god. My name is Sothis. By now you must be well aware of what that means. I am the one who watches over Fodlin and the creatures dwelling there. I am Sothis. She who died, and then returned. There is but one thing left to do to save us from this darkness of eternity. I must now use the power of a god. However, I lack a body of my own. And so, I must relinquish all the power that I have... ...to you. The time has come for you and I to join as one. And when that comes to pass, then I shall disappear. When I say disappear, I do not mean that all I am will be no more. My soul will join with yours, and you and I will never be apart. But... I will no longer have the chance to speak with you. I shall miss it. So long have I been on this path with you. Through you, I got to see and hear this world. I even got to chastise you from time to time. I may not have acted like a goddess, but... It was certainly fun. For all that you have done, thank you. I'm glad that it was you to whom my fate was bound. Now, we must pray. For if we share this wish, our spirits too will join as one. Your wish is to return to the forest, stop the enemy, and rescue the little ones. <laughs> no need for words. I know your heart as though it were my own. <laughs> your will and mine are now as one. Both sides of time are revealed to you, and you alone. You know I am the beginning. What shall you do?
Professor, that is you, isn't it? I'm glad you are safe. I was sure that you would return. Please tell me all that happened to you later. For now, it's imperative that we kill the demon. What did you see in the darkness of Zaharas? This should be impossible. The only being that can withstand that darkness is... Unless I dispose of you myself, I may never have the chance to send you back there. All right, fusing with Sothis allowed the sword of the creator to regain its true power. <laughs> so it has now become the sublime creator sword, which is a pretty good weapon. And it enables you to use the attacking skill Sublime Heaven. Which is much better than its previous version. So, it's going to be very similar. We're just playing on the second half of the map. You do want to be careful, there are two more demon monsters, so you don't want to just overwhelm yourself by going too far out. Alright. Get that taken care of. And as you can see, that's quite a bit. Uh, we're just going to use the silver sword currently. We're going to save that the sublime creator sword Each battle for the demons that we're going to have to be fighting. And that's the other reason why I said probably best to do that before we defeat Kranya because they move everyone up here. So that way you don't have to worry about running backward. Also if you defeat Kranya before you defeat every other enemy the other enemies are still going to be here, so you would have to worry about them as well. That's why it's also a good idea to just go ahead and take care of everyone before you defeat, uh, before you beat her. All right. And Sublime Heaven just makes that pretty much a joke, but it doesn't quite no do. Hesitation. Well, I was going to say it doesn't do enough to justify using it, and he just crits anyway, without having to use anything. Got training gauntlets, we don't really need those. Uh, got experience, alright, got a gambit use back, and we're going to go ahead and heal Gaspar for 1 HP. It's not much, but Sylvain's not going to be like, an, like a main healer, so I'm not too worried about it. Um, uh, Sunder. There we go. Um... Yeah. There we go, she's got a bee sword. Not quite what I was after. Yeah. Now. Well, she's got an axe breaker, so that's a good thing. Um, not that much else would be replaced. 
Uh... Are you gonna crit again? Yes, you are. Nice. Thank you, Felix. I expect no less. Felix is actually really good. <laughs> okay. Get some experience, please. And recover the gambit use. I don't think she used it, though. And just bulligon him. Uh, Ash, if you'd be so kind. You really going to try that? All right. As expected. Have fun. We must all do our part. But yeah, Blyce got his stats covered. The better to serve his highest. That's better. You need to get more speed and dex and charm. And all the things, dude. <laughs> well, you have my est. Let the lesson begin. Well, <laughs> you didn't give it your all. Um, <laughs> do, do I need to really worry about Blythe? No, not at all. He, he's just a monster at this point. No hesitation. All right, he's got a B plus for his authority. Practice yields results. Which makes that a lot nicer. Um, and we'll have Caspar take out this guy. Yeah, it worked. Pretty good, don't you think? All right, he got charm. I mean, Caspar has his own charm anyway, but that 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 is just something else. Alright, um... I don't know where I was honestly going with that. I was trying to think of something clever, but you know, didn't work. Alright, regardless, let's just move on. Um... Gonna dance for Felix here. Go ahead and deal with this guy. You never had a chance. Oh no, one damage. That turned into nothing, because Aegeus activated. 
Oh, how he must have felt jibbed. And I am just thinking that's absolutely hilarious. Alright. getting there. Oh yeah. Convoy. I want to drop this off before I forget. Because I, I know I will. Also, I swapped out some of the abilities. I don't want Blight stealing all the fun. That didn't quite work. Why am I even here? Because I want you to be here. <laughs> Stronger, huh? We'll see. Hey, you're turning out to be quite the beast, Felix. Just chill out, dude. Cause... Yeah. That was tough. All right, Ash. Oh, that's a good level up. Let's go ahead and heal Ash. Because he's got some. His health isn't all that great right now. Alright. Just slowly start moving things around. No time to waste on the likes of you. Try again. And just one shot the guy. You fought well. He's almost actually at a B plus for that. All right. Yeah, so pretty much 
nothing is going to be a fantastic option comparing to how things might end up turning out. Okay. It was my crit, we're good. To think so. that I would lose to mere beasts. Well that's just plain rude. Slow and steady. But this is not the end. Tullus will carry out our mission somehow. Tullus? Does he also serve the Flame Emperor? It can't be! Everyone's motivation got better. Why, thank you so much! You're very welcome. Professor, I'm glad you're okay. And you seem relatively unscathed. I'm... I'm so relieved. What's more, Gerald's foe is dead. Though we took little satisfaction from it. Professor, I must ask. What happened after we were separated? You look... different. The goddess appeared and gave you her power? It's as though the legend of old has been made flesh. It's hard to grasp, in all honesty. But having seen you pierce the sky with my own eyes, I find myself unable to doubt it. Yes, the legend of Saint Seros. It is said that she received a divine revelation from the goddess and was gifted with her power. Long ago, the goddess dispatched Seros to defeat an evil king who went mad with power. Perhaps the goddess saw the goodness of Seros within you too, and wished to help you in your quest to defeat evil. <laughs> if you're Seros, granted power by the goddess, then I suppose that makes me... Ah, never mind. I'm getting carried away. Professor, what's wrong? Are you... Uh, are you asleep? What is happening these days? Well, it matters not. We must get you help, and fast. It'll be faster if I carry you and run. Professor, you must remain still. Everything is all right. There is no need to worry. Those who are trying to harm you are far away. How lovely it would be for this moment to last forever. I wish I could hold on to this time we have stolen. That you and I could create a world without end. I have heard whispers of what happened to you. Your appearance. You have received power from the goddess. From the moment you took hold of the sword of the creator. I prayed that one day the radiant power of Sothis, which bathes Fodlin in its celestial light, might reside within you. But you are so much more than the light. You are my... <sighs> Close your eyes, dear one. Sleep just a while longer. 
I will be watching over you. Always. Always and forever.